With some of our leading teams in the Australian Rally Championship having dramas on our dry, dusty roads in Western Australia. But who is our leader at the lunchtime service? It's this lady here, Molly Taylor. Look at the smile, says it all. Going really well. Yeah, look, we've been, you know, really just trying to keep our head down and, and really just focus on each stage and learning the car and just getting a good rhythm and it, it seems to be working so all we can do is just keep doing what we're doing and you know at the end of the day we you know you can't control anything outside the car so we're just enjoying enjoying the car and enjoying the roads. I mean obviously I wanted to be up and battling up the you know in the in the top handful but I, I didn't think I'd be coming here and winning stages and be leading the leg uh, up at this point so that's certainly As you say one stage win under your belt already in the first round. Fantastic so far, and I think you, there's lots of people that are now stepping up and taking notice of uh, Molly Taylor in our Australian Championship. Yeah, I think you know it was important to me to come back to Australia and do a good job because yeah, you know it's very easy when you're going, you know, competing on the other side of the world, you don't have a, a real reference of you know how you're actually getting on. So, you know, it was important for myself to um, to come and, and do a good job. So I'm, I'm happy that you know we're at where we're at, but I just really want to, you know, keep my head switched on and uh, keep focusing on the job. We got a flat tyre on the Alice stage with 5k to go, so I tried to keep the speed up as much as I could, but got to the end we lost a lot of time to Molly and Tony, so unfortunate. I think we might be out of the hunt today now, but um, went through the next stage, Healthway Loop, felt really good, so our time was a couple of seconds faster than Simon. I know he's having dramas, but it's still a positive, so, and I think we were 18 faster than Tony, so it's a step in the right direction. We got off to a cracking start, we kept talking about on the tarmac, and since we've hit the ground, we've been drama after drama you've been sort of coping with. Yeah, exactly. It's just, you know, this is what rallying's about. You've got to drive around problems and issues and keep bringing the car back so the boys can fix it. And the car's getting better and better, but we've, we've just got this one, and it's an engine problem at the moment, which is, we think it's a crank angle sensor, and then the clutch completely failed on us, leaving the service here last time. So we've just done those couple of stages with no clutch at all, so... It was, it's been a challenging day, but I brought the car back and, and the boys are into it and they know exactly what the problem is and that's the key, you know, so now, now they can fix it. The intercom wasn't working, we swapped the driver's side to the co-driver's side so that at least I could hear it most of the time. Got three corners into the first of those last two stages and cut out altogether, so we did the whole stage with hand signals and, yeah, it was very frustrating, so I, 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 I think I did pretty well considering it was basically a blind, a blind stage. Have you fixed that problem with Intercom or you know, no, 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 no. Uh, lent us, Justin Dow's lent us a new, well, second air new Peltor uh, with a, the Stillo adapters and all that sort of stuff. So hopefully it'll all work and we should be good for the next couple. Final round of the year last year was not the greatest way we wanted to finish, but it's been a long time out of the car for us. Uh, yesterday was all about just getting some seat time and today find our feet again and the last two stages have been really good, so very comfortable. It seems like you've got a strategy for this event and for your championship. You know, you're in the ARC and all that sort of stuff, but you know, you're focused on your championship and all the WA guys are going fast. Yeah, they are. They, you're not wrong. I mean, you look up the, the pointy end, there's three guys running up the top field. I mean, we're just trying to keep our nose clean, see what happens with them. We want to be as close, bit of pressure on them. At the same time, we're just running our own race at the moment and just yeah, try and keep it out there circulating is the most important part for us. Now the problems are out of the way, mate. Two stage wins. So that shows what can happen when you just relax and get in the groove in this thing. Yeah, it was a good uh, good couple of runs. We um, we lost Intercom in the first one out, so I couldn't hear Dale for the the last little bit. But the health way, we made a couple of little mistakes. But no, it was it was a good run, and it was um, yeah actually nice to have a couple of fun stages. You're leading the uh, four wheel drive challenge, mate. Going really well, mate. Yeah, the first few stages took a bit to get used to it. The car again, like it's been a while since we've been in it, and that was so loose. Um, so yeah, we we took it easy. Um, then the third stage we had an attack again, same as the fourth one. Pulled nine seconds on Doug, so we're now we're back, on, back in the lead again, so uh, yeah, good please.